Winter is just around the corner and I still love to ride outside despite the cold temperature. I even have two fat bikes right behind me. I like to ride outside all year long. The trainer is great, but nothing beats the experience of riding outside. But there's one thing that can completely ruin your experience of riding in the winter. And it's the clothing. If you don't have the right gear, you're gonna suffer, you're gonna get cold, and you're gonna just hate riding outside. But cycling all year long can be quite expensive. And I like to show you guys some budget options that can get you guys on the bike without breaking the bank. So thanks to the sponsor of this video, we're gonna take a look at Sirocco winter line of clothing. They're a Spanish company and they sent out a full winter kit for me to try out and show you guys how it is, tell you guys my experience with their winter kit and we're gonna go outside and right now, today, it is one degree Celsius and I'm really not looking forward to ride outside, but if their clothing is appropriate for the colder time, then I should be totally fine. So this is everything that they sent. It's one full kit and the beauty of Sirocco is how inexpensive it is, but how much quality and value you're getting for that price point. So let's first start with their winter bib. So at first look, we already see that it's a winter bib because there's a second liner inside of it. It doesn't look too thick, but it definitely will cut the wind and it will be warmer. I like the fact what I see here that there is this stretchier part around the knee that will allow for maybe better flexibility of the bib. It will be more comfortable. Big white decals here and a reflective band at the back. This is great. It looks stretchy enough. The straps look that they went for a more breathable, is a mesh and not uh, the full liner that is on the inside, is you don't want it to be too warm because then you're gonna be sweating in your back and then you're gonna get cold. So the fact that it's a mesh, uh, it will evaporate the heat, it will evaporate your moisture, and it should be uh, for a better experience. I like the fact that there's a pocket inside of here. I'm not too sure what I, put, I would put in that pocket. Looking at the chamois, this looks like the chamois I've tried before, it's, uh, maybe on the SRX bib. Uh, it's very, very cushy. I can't wait to put my butt on it. So next, we're gonna take a look at a thicker jersey, or more like a GABA jersey. That's definitely a more on the winter side of jerseys. It's very, very soft. I kinda like it. And the color looks great. I like the red. We see at the back there are the three pockets. We have a zipper. Thank God we have a zipper. I hate when there's no zipper around this. It does feel protected and warmer. And what I love to say at the bottom here is this big band that will surely um, hold the jacket maybe down to your lower back, to the uh, top of your butt. Uh, maybe it would have been nice to have more grip. So the only grip of this big band is the Sirocco logo. Just this jacket alone, uh, I would say that seven to 12, 13 degrees. Uh, if you're more towards that seven, maybe have a wind vest, it could be a nice addition to it. But this kit looks pretty good so far. Next, take a look at the bigger jacket. It's a lot thicker and it will be a lot warmer. Zipper feels good. Let me see on the inside and we have some additional insulation. This is definitely a, like a five degree weather jacket. If we look at the back, we don't have dedicated pockets, but we have reflective details at the bottom. And we do have one bigger zip on this side, which leads to pretty much half of the pocket here. And we have another zip on the other side that leads to the other half. So. It's cool that there's pockets. Maybe it could have been nice if we had external pocket as well uh, for uh, maybe quicker and easier access to your phone and all of that. But looking at this, it looks great. I like to see this very, very sticky bend at the bottom of the jacket. And now, I think that we have like a solid zero degree winter setup. Uh, this would be perfect for fat biking for me. So if I would be riding road around that five degree weather, I might go for this bigger jacket, but maybe with just a regular jersey inside of it. So uh, you can breathe a little bit more, but this jacket looks great. It looks to me like it will cut the wind, it will keep you warm and protected from the element. It's maybe even a little bit waterproof. The droplets just keep sliding down. This is great. 
That's awesome. This is definitely something that you want uh, if you're riding in the colder temperature, in the rain, in the snow. You want something that the water will slip. And Sirocco also included some more accessories to finish this kit. They included some merino wool socks. Highly, highly, highly suggest that you guys get merino socks. And then for the gloves, uh, these are insulated thermos. The glove is fully decked out with grip. Um, for myself, this is a must. I don't want to slip on my handlebars and on my brake levers when it get cold. So this glove fits me very well, actually. Yeah. And also we see that the tip of the fingers, both the thumb and the main finger is touch control. So you can use your phone and yeah, why don't you just follow me on Instagram at the same time. All right. So it's now time for me to try out this kit. Let's do a trendy TikTok transition. Woo! The bib feels very nice. I love it. I can definitely tell about the waterproofing of these bibs. I very like the fact how stretchy and flexible this part around the knee is. No difficulty for me to put it on despite no zipper. Let's put the red jacket on. The fabric is very nice. How's the fit? You guys tell me, how's the fit? I feel good though. It goes down a lot, down, down to the butt. So if you're on the bike, trying to be hero, man, I'm genuinely surprised right now. I know this is a sponsored video, but I'm truly speaking my words here and what I'm thinking. This feels very nice. All right, the jacket is on and it's flexible. The arms feels good. I can stretch, I can go down with my bars. In terms of the sizing, this full kit is a medium for me. So medium bib, jersey, and jacket. Uh, I am five foot six, 150 pounds. So I hope this might help you guys find out the best size for you. All right, so enough talking about the product. It's now time for me to go outside and truly test it into the real world. It's one degree Celsius. I'm not looking forward to hit the road, but for you guys watching this YouTube video, I'm willing to be testing this kit to its claim and see if they can actually keep me warm during this very cold cycling ride. All right, guys, so I'm running out with my buddy, Andre. What's up, Andre? I'm good. It's his birthday today and uh, he's <laughs> joining us for a, a very cold ride. Uh, what's the loop you have planned for us? Maybe 30 kilometer loop? Yeah. All right, 30. Let's do it. We have to test the clothing. So we are 10 kilometers into the ride and I'm feeling good. The only place I'm a little bit cold might be, might be the fingertips, but these gloves are more like a 7 to 12 degrees. So I think Sirocco has thicker gloves for winter, but the jacket, the bib, I'm feeling good. All right, so 20K in and I'm feeling good. We've done a few efforts, uh, some sprints, some acceleration up this little, the only climbs we have around here, which is only uh, overpass, <laughs> a little bit lame, uh, but I'm, I'm not sweaty inside. I'm feeling good. We're back home. Thank you, Ali. It's been a pleasure. You're a warrior and uh, happy birthday. Thanks. I'm gonna ask the guys at Sirocco to send you a kit for uh, braving, uh, braving the cold with me today. What's your, what's your uh, size? Medium. Medium? Yeah. All right. Let's make it happen. All right. Well, that has been a 
pretty sweet. 35 kilometer with my buddy Andre. It was cold. It was windy. It was shady. There was no sun, no light rays to warm the body up. But I feel it was a very good test for me to try out this kit from Sirocco. Now, after one ride, what is my thoughts? What is my final opinion on this kit? Well, I am generally surprised with the quality of this kit in consideration of the price point of this kit. The bib is probably one of my, I, I wanna say that my best winter bib I've had. I really love the fabric that they chose. I really felt that the wind was cut out from the outside of the bib, the chamois, Super comfortable, cushy, like I said earlier. 10 out of 10 for the bib. The price point is very good as well. No, nothing bad to say. All right, now what about this jersey? Um, I mean, I wish I had the opportunity to try it in maybe that 10 to 15 degree weather, but the fabric is soft. The pockets are very well placed. I like uh, the reach. There's enough space for everything. It looks good. And I like the style, the two colors. That's great. No other bad words about it. I feel that uh, it's a good jersey. See, my only concern here with this uh, winter kit is coming from the jacket. So two downside for the jacket. No pockets, uh, easily accessible from the top. So your phone kind of needs to either go like in your pockets from your jersey under, then it's like a hassle to go reach. My snacks were in this pocket and I did not went and access them. And the zipper provided, they were like too small, too difficult to open or close with one hand. I was not able to do it while riding. So for me, this jacket, it, despite the fact that the, the quality and the warmth of it is decent, the fact that the pockets are not easily accessible, uh, I would pass on this one. But the bib, this jersey, the gloves, they were great. Uh, the grip was great. The fingertip to touch the phone was great. Nothing bad to say about this. The glasses, I mean, it's up to you guys to tell me how they look. I personally feel that they're not my favorite. The build quality is a little bit flimsy, um, but yeah, they are right. And for the price point, I don't remember by heart, I'm gonna put the price of these glasses, but it's very affordable. And uh, if you don't wanna spend $300 on a pair of Oakleys, this is a decent alternative. All right, guys, so this is it for my video in collaboration with Sirocco. If you guys want to check it out, please use the link in the description down below. Uh, it's an affiliate link, so I will receive kickback back from this sale. So it funds this YouTube channel for me to become a full-time cyclist. So thank you. I gotta say, you guys, you won't be disappointed. The quality is there. The value is there. I don't think I know any other brand that gives you so much product for the price. Um, yes, you will find better bibs. Yes, you will find better jerseys out there. But you will pay a few hundred dollars per piece and a full kit will run you into the, the thousands of dollars, especially the winter kits where because they can get quite expensive. But yeah, maybe this could be a great option for a gift for your friends and family uh, and, or for yourself. This is Black Friday that is about to start at Sirocco. Their prices are super good. And you can get a lot of cycling kits for a decent amount of money for good quality products. So yeah, I love my Sirocco kits. I'm sure you guys will love it too. All right, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget, leave a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already. And my name is Charles and I will see you guys on the road or into the next video. Peace.